Hey, what's up, guys? All right. In this video, we're going to be talking about one change that you can do in order to actually stand out from the rest of your competition. And in this video, we're going to be talking about Juicy Couture. I personally work with this brand for a very, very long time for their emails. Um, they have a lot of users in the back end when it comes to acquisition side of things. So whatever these guys are using in the front end, it's very simple, easy to understand layout, and it works. Uh, for them and it's a pretty big brand when it comes to um, uh, their specific customer avatar so this video might help you so when it comes to standing out and building a good user experience for your landing page uh, on Shopify or your e-commerce store there are some things that you have to make sure to actually uh, make it easier for the user to actually purchase a product so regardless of the product category that you may have the important thing is one of the things that I personally um, experience a lot of times when clients, they start working with me, the big and a very, very common problem is that they don't have enough pictures of their products onto the actual product page. And that's a big, big turnoff for a lot of people. If you're running paid ads or social media ads, enough images helps you stand out more and you have to have like multiple angles of your pictures in order to basically show like hey this is the front this is the back this is the how the sides looks like and all that right and the second thing i want to talk about is the right side where you actually use the description of the products so you have title you have pricing you have color add to back pretty basic stuff they're using something very unique and a lot of brands are, they just started using this uh, extremely important trick to actually upsell the products right off the bat is completing the look with the top, the bottom. In this specific case, you can see like, this is like a, the tank top, and then you can complete the look with the hoodie and the bottoms. Um, it's just like a bomber jacket. But the whole set is like $119 extra that, that you have to pay in order to on top of $39, right? So for example, if Juicy Couture is paying, let's say $20 to acquire a customer in the front end, they can still make $119 technically profit after, you know, operation costs, shipping, uh, whatever the profit is left, you made that technically for free without paying to acquire a customer. So... <clears throat> Use these tricks to actually um, add it into your store uh, to talk uh, the completing the look or add on products. If you're using specific products, try to use uh, different variations of the products and try to upsell them um, to actually uh, d turn down your cost per acquisition, but also making more profit up front. The second thing I want to talk about is, of course, like for you section, a lot of e-commerce brands has this. But the important thing is you can actually see right here, these are a little bit more customizable. So if I'm looking at a black color, it will show me like more black, more tanks, and you may like. So these are like three different categories and they all serve different purpose. So if I'm looking for a tank top, I might like more tanks. I wanna see more tanks. Maybe I wanna see more black color. Okay, maybe I want to see different products. So you have to customize um, whatever you can on your product pages in order to stand out more, um, to actually sell more. Um, so I hope this video helps you. My name is Stanley. I'm a part of Infobase.io. If you need more customizations and help with the strategy side of things for your online e-commerce store, be sure to click the link in the description below. Schedule a call with me. I would be happy to help. All right, bye.